Okay, um, so today uh, what we're going to work on is the short balls. Okay, so if you guys remember yesterday, what we did is just kind of kind of launch the ball, right? We just launched the ball all the way there. Okay, yes, okay. And that's just to mentally give you the idea that hitting the ball out is fine. Okay, when you're trying to attempt to hit a, a short ball, okay? Uh, it's uh, not good to be restrictive. It's not good to just play it safe. You want to hit that ball, okay? Um, the other thing is, uh, you know, sometimes I say you want to be aggressive on the short ball, and that's partly true, but a better word would be assertive, okay? You want to be assertive in your short balls, okay? Can anyone tell me what that means, being assertive? What does assertive mean? Kind of like being committed, right? Being committed, yeah, you want to be committed. Hit it with confidence. Hit it with confidence, good, being, okay. Being, don't be out of control. Sometimes if you yes. Out of control. Assertive True. control. Yes. Yes, yes, that's exactly right. So if you if you're gonna be aggressive, right? Sometimes when you're aggressive, you're out of control. You could like you could like run into the net and just go ah. You're gonna hit it, and that's that's being aggressive, but that's not being in control. So being assertive means you are giving yourself. You're you're intending to hit that shot wherever you need it to be. You know you're you're aggressive in that way, but also controlled in your approach. Okay, so you have to be aggressive, you have to be controlled, and you have to have intention, right? That's, that's being assertive, okay? So you could actually hit the ball hard if you like, you know, that's being assertive, trying to get to your spot, but being assertive on a short ball can also mean uh, doing a drop shot, right? Just to kind of do a drop shot, and that's, that's being assertive too, that, but that's not being super aggressive or anything like that. Uh, but that's what you have to be, okay? You can never really play it safe on a short ball because why? Why can't kill you? Because, uh, so it's a short ball, right? Okay, you're, say it's a short ball around here and you have to hit, you have to hit a backhand over here, okay? Are you in a safe spot or a vulnerable spot? Yes, you are a very vulnerable shot, okay? So if you just kind of dink it over like that, you are doomed. You're going to get passed. They have all options on the table. But if you're offensive, you're aggressive, you hit a, you know, forehand right there to your spot, come into the net, uh, being assertive, then uh, you can gain control of that point. You're on the offensive and you'll win that point, most likely, okay? So that's what you have to be on the short balls. It's okay to hit it out, you know, you attempt to hit it out or you attempt to hit it in, good short ball, and it goes out, that's okay, okay? I'm okay with you hitting the ball out a hundred times, your whole match. You hit a short ball out, you lose the match, that's better than winning the match and playing it safe on the short balls, okay? Because we all want to improve, we all want to learn, and we all want to get better, right? It's not just about winning, right? Uh, any questions on that? Uh, any questions? So, the technique on short balls, okay? The short balls need to have a little bit of a shorter backswing. You can't take a full cut, not like, you know, where you are in the baseline. You want to take a shorter backswing, not, you know, super compact or anything, but it should be uh, slightly less on your backswing, okay? And uh, the other thing, uh, is that you want to lean in on your approach, okay? So uh, the short ball is using an approach shot. So you don't want to kind of hit a ball and then just come up like that and then go, okay? You don't, <laughs> right, okay? So you want to kind of lean in, like lean in to your shot and then go. Why, why, why is that better? Because you're moving forward with that. Yeah, you're moving forward, the momentum goes through and you're not halted, right? So if you hit and then just like go like this, and then you you're like a, you know for a second you're like a statue, right? You can't you can't. So yeah, I mean you know if an opponent sees that, uh, they just go to the other side of the court, and you don't have time to recover, and you're doomed on that point. Okay, so you want to lean in, shorter backswing, and if you 
hit out it hit out it's okay just work on that technique and uh, you'll get better with the short balls okay hey guys thanks for watching follow me on twitter and instagram at topspinadrian and check out some of my other videos see you next time